New at 5 o'clock, tonight we are hearing concerns from CARTA passengers about operations of the public bus system. News 2's Katie Augustine spoke with a loyal, loyal CARTA rider who says he's surprised by some of the things he's experienced while on the bus. These buses can get you from point A to B. But Joshua Blanton, whose family relies on public transportation, every day, Monday through Friday, says a trip with CARTA could cost you more than just the bus fare. The buses are never really on time. The drivers drive erratically. I've been thrown out of the seat twice. Blanton says he's also seen what he claims are illegal activities. His biggest concerns, though, cleanliness and straying from the schedule. The buses will show up early sometimes, and they don't wait until the time that they're supposed to be there. And they just drive off. I tested it out for myself here at a bus stop in Mount Pleasant. Carta's website said a bus was supposed to arrive here at 1147. It arrived at 1142, but left at 1144. The next one, not for another hour. If you can't get the job work on time because you're having to rely on public transportation, nobody's going to keep you. I reached out to Carta for a response to Blanton's concerns. They sent me a statement that says in part, quote, maintaining the safety of Carta passengers and drivers is our top priority. And that's why our approach is threefold. Carta says they have a zero tolerance policy for harassment and other illegal activity. Drivers are permitted to take short breaks and they maintain rigorous cleaning protocols. You can read the full statement on our website, countonto.com. I'm Katie Augustine, Count on Two.